Before we start, I'd like to clarify when you would need to do this. If you have a car that's in storage or sitting for months or years, you may have a drained battery. But uh, for someone who forgot to turn their lights off, uh, the instrument panel still lights up, you hear the starter clicking, just refer to our first video on how to use the jump starter. So here we go. We're going to show you what happens if you have a completely drained battery. In this case, here's a voltmeter to show you the uh, what's the voltage on this particular battery. 3.9 millivolts. So this is completely drained. Um, in this case, you would have to pre-charge your jump starter elsewhere using one of the three methods that we uh, talk about. And for here, we try to save time, so it's already pre-charged, ready to go. So just connect the clamps to the terminal. And in this case, since the battery is completely dead, um, there's no juice to uh, close the uh, circuit on the relay. So um, you would have to do the override. And that you do by press and hold the uh, on-off button. You see the green light flashing. And if, when it stays solid, you're ready to go.